What's up everybody? I'm Danny DeVries with Origins TV and right now I'm going to walk you through a quick ingredient list and step-by-step -step instruction on the best venison marinade. Now this is comparison to the best elk marinade that we published a few years ago, but this one's a little bit quicker. You don't have as long as a, a marinating time for this one and there's a few less ingredients. So let's get into the ingredients. I'm gonna show you guys a really cool recipe that's gonna take your grilling venison to the next level this fall. Some of the liquid ingredients you're gonna need for this marinade includes three tablespoons of Worcestershire, two tablespoons of soy sauce, one teaspoon of liquid smoke, two teaspoons of balsamic vinaigrette, and one quarter cup of olive oil. Once you've got about two pounds of venison in a bag, that's what this marinade runs for, you can go ahead and add all your liquid ingredients. You want to kind of get those to marry before you start adding in your dry ingredients. For the dry ingredients, it includes one half teaspoon of salt, one half teaspoon of pepper, one teaspoon of garlic powder, one teaspoon of onion powder, one tablespoon of minced garlic, one teaspoon of McCormick Chipotle roasted garlic seasoning. Now, you don't need to add the grill mates from McCormick. I kind of like to have a little bit of smokiness. It doesn't add too much spice. It's very minimal with the other ingredients here, but if you choose to do so, that is McCormick Chipotle roasted garlic grill mates seasoning. And just like that, you're ready to go with this wonderful marinade. Usually I'll let it sit for maybe five to 20 minutes. What you do wanna do, some grilling tips, is make sure you remove the venison from the refrigerator uh, about 45 minutes before you take it to the grill. And then for preparation on the grill, make sure you turn your grill on to high heat and then reduce it to medium heat after preheating it for about 10 to 15 minutes. Take your venison, grill it on each side for about a minute and a half and then keep flipping about every 45 seconds until you've been grilling your venison for about five minutes to six minutes total, depending on the size of your steak. But if you do that, that's gonna give you a great steak, a great meal for your friends, your family, any entertainment, or just anything um, that you like with your venison. This will also work for beef, it'll work for duck. If you wanna cook teal this way and thinly slice a teal breast, it'll work for that, it'll work for mallard, um, moose, elk, Deer. This is whitetail. We harvested this one about three weeks ago and we tried this marinade for the first time um, just a few weeks ago and it turned out fantastic. So check out the marinade. I hope you guys enjoy it and let me know what you think.